and welcome to the hot air balloon topic. In this topic we're going to be learning about how a hot air balloon works. So in order to learn about this we're going to start by considering weight which is caused by gravity and the weight force as you know is what pulls the hot air balloon down. While we're considering hot air balloons, we'll also have a quick look at air resistance because air resistance is the force which something would feel if you dropped it off the side of a hot air balloon. Or if a parachuter jumps out of an aircraft, it's the air resistance which is going to slow them down. So in order to understand how hot air balloons get off the ground, we're going to have to look at the buoyancy force. So we'll be looking at buoyancy forces and Archimedes principle. Archimedes principle is quite exciting because it was probably the first actual eureka moment in science. It's said that when Archimedes discovered this principle, he ran to the sheets, streets shouting eureka. We'll also be looking at the ideal gas law. The ideal gas law will tell us how the volume of a gas changes as we heat it up. And changing the volume will lead to a change in the density and this lower density is actually what's going to result in the buoyancy force which leads to the hot air balloon taking off. So I hope you enjoy this topic.